What's up guys? Welcome back to the Secret of Monkey Island. We're here with Guybrush. We've just repaired the rowboat and that means we can finally explore around the north side of the island so without wasting any time. Aside from the fact that Guybrush rows incredibly slowly, let's go around and explore the north side. So just for those, uh, in case you've forgotten, we are um, looking for Elaine Marley, governor of Melee Island. She's been captured by LeChuck. Um, and hiding inside the sacred monkey head here on Monkey Island is LeChuck's there, and we need to try and figure out how to get inside, which seems like we need to speak to the cannibals because they've got um, Herman Toothrot, who's the local hermit. It's so complicated. They've got his banana picker and he's got their key to the sacred monkey head. So we got to get his banana picker to get the key to get into the monkey head to rescue Elaine from the Chuck who was taken from Melee Island and is now here on Monkey Island. Oh, goodness. It's not as complicated as it sounds, <laughs> but yes, um, this is the part of the island we haven't been to yet. So let's have a look around. We've got a note here. Cannibals. From the cannibals. I'm not giving you bloodsuckers your key to the monkey head until you return my banana picker. See, there we go. That's what we got to do. H.T. Herman Toothrot. Right. If he can get to the side of the island, I'll be really annoyed because I need to know his shortcut. Because we had to like find the oars to the rowboat to do that. This really looks like a bird, guys. Like, this is the head, and, like, down below is, like, the wings and everything. Um, anyway, this looks like the cannibal village. It must be. There's not much else on this map. Ooh, looks very deserted. What is that? That does not look good. Um, what else? We've got a hut. It's an empty hut. Yep. Still empty. <laughs> Still empty. Yep. Still empty. <laughs> you don't want to walk inside, Guybrush. See what's inside. Oh, all these huts I can't empty. See inside from here. But I'll bet it's empty. <laughs> I can't see inside from here. Oh, Guybrush. But I'll bet it's empty. Yeah, probably empty, right? This hut is very empty. Yep. Still empty. Boy, this is the emptiest <laughs> I've ever seen. <laughs> I love this game. It just like it plays with your expectations. It's awesome. Is that a face in the clouds? What is that? Okay, let's uh, explore this side. We got a door. Can we open it? Mm, this door appears to be locked. Right. Every other door in this village is empty. Is open and empty, but that one is locked. No two ways about it. This hut's empty. Yep. Still empty. No two ways about it, Guybrush. Why all the huts empty? That's really spooky. So we've got a bunch of bones here. We got some spears. Giant stone head. Empty. Even the stone head is empty, guys. That's not good. I don't want to get any closer to that thing. <laughs> it might be booby trapped. <laughs> is that why you're just not walking into anything? We got some fruit here. Looks a little overripe, except for those nice juicy bananas. And for some reason, we're collecting bananas. I still haven't figured it out. I'm sure there's a reason. Like, how many bananas do we have now? One, two, three, four, five. We have five bananas. I don't know why we're collecting these things. Mm, this door appears to be locked. Really? Is that it for the village? That's, um, there's got to be something here that I'm missing, right? Maybe, oh, hello. Is that a banana in your pocket? Or are you just glad to see us? <laughs> You've got a lot of nerve stealing from the notorious Monkey Island cannibals. You're cannibals? Yeah, well, but we don't eat humans. Yes. Although lately, we've been trying to stay away from red meat. I remember that much. <laughs> oh, for We're still uh, as vicious as ever. How are you cannibals? Oh, especially with tourists who try to steal our stuff for souvenirs. I feel like I'm the first tourist well, in like a decade or more. What do you have to say for yourself? Um... <laughs> the classic line from Monkey Island. Look behind you! A three-headed monkey! Hey, <laughs> do you really think we're that stupid? I wouldn't push it if I were you. Well, you never know, you know. Um... Right. Whoa, there really is a three-headed monkey, Look guys! You. A three-headed monkey! Ha! We're not going to fall for that old trick again. <laughs> I guess we're the two now. Oh man, Unless, I love this. If you had some sort of offering for us, mm -hmm. something that we could pass on to the great monkey, well. Um. To the great monkey? How about 
Banana? Oh, no, but that's... You already have bananas. Um... Pamphlet, leaflets, brochures, dusty book. Can I give them bananas? Obviously, you oh. have nothing for us. <laughs> they we know. Might eat you, we might let you go. We'll have to talk about it with the village nutritionist. Oh. Come, let me show you our guest hunt. The monkey's even following us, guys. That should do it. Really? Two spears in front of the door will do it? I doubt it. Hmm, this door appears to be locked. Appears to be locked. You're not even going to look. Why is this a note? To the ghost pirate LeChuck. LeChuck. We must protest your acquisition of our voodoo anti root He's got the anti root You realize that it presents a hazard to you and your crew, but this is thievery. The Monkey Island Cannibals. Right, I forgot this. So early on, the voodoo lady told us that we need a voodoo root, anti root thing, because it kills ghosts or like defeats LeChuck or something like that. Um, I forgot that, and that the cannibals had it, or something, or it was on Monkey Island, I can't remember. Um, but yeah, it appears LeChuck has stolen it. I think that's how I'll end up if I don't get out of here soon. Yeesh! Not good. Okay, let's, um, let's pick this up. No thanks. They've still got some meat on them. Oh, that doesn't help anybody. What's out the window? I can't get through it. Oh, this is the banana picker! Wow. It says, if found, please return to Herman Toothrot. That thing is huge. No, pick up, not use. Pick up. That thing is huge. How do you put that in your pants, Skybrush? How are you doing it? You got superpowers or something. Crazy. Um, got a skull here. Ooh, cute little skull. Okay, my keyboard is bugging out on me again. For some reason. Ah! Need to fix the batteries on this thing. Okay, um, what we got? You have banana picker. It says, it's too huge. To Herman we definitely can't open the door. Hmm, this door appears to be locked. Okay, let's pick up the skull. What are we gonna do with that skull? Has it got a name? A cute little skull. Is it Murray? If anyone's played Curse of Monkey Island, they'll know exactly who Murray is. Fortunately, I don't think he's anywhere until Monkey Island 3. Loose Looks board. Loose. Okay. Pick up. Loose board. Where? Alright, let's go through that. that hole, but I don't think this banana picker will. Oh no, that's not good. No, Gavish, don't leave the banana picker. That's what we need. Gavish. <laughs> Sneaking out to the empty village. Oh, and not so empty no, anymore. I'm not getting squeamish. I'd love to eat the guy. <laughs> So let's do it. But think of your arteries. <laughs> we are cannibals for crying out loud. Yeah, but cannibals have to watch their saturated fats just like everyone else. Why, and Guybrush has got a lot of saturated fats. I doubt it. <laughs> are these birds following us? That's a little scary. Okay, is there nothing we can access from this side of the island? What's down? Oh, I don't think we can get down there. Guybrush doesn't look like he's gonna walk there. Looks like he's gonna stop somewhere here. And say I can't go further. No, he's walking. He's walking. He's just walking very slowly for some reason. It's all those saturated fat skybrush. Think of your arteries, dude. Okay, no, he can't go any further. Oh, hello. He can, turns out. But there's nothing here anyway. Okay, let's head um, back. Uh, let's go back to the village, see if we can't get that banana picker out somehow. These vultures are following us. Is this hut, is this hut still empty? I bet if I looked up empty in the dictionary, I'd get a picture of this hut. <laughs> yep. you're still literally up. just getting snarky with me now, dude. Okay, um... This door appears to be locked. Still locked. Nothing left but bad fruit. So we can't get inside now? Mm, at all? This door appears to be locked. What do we do then? We can't get inside. Oh, they're back! Ah, Great. the banana thief returns <laughs> to the scene of the crime. Maybe we should just eat him right now. <laughs> do you have any idea how much cholesterol is <laughs> in these things? Oh, man. Now then, how did you break out of our hut? And why did you come back? Um, 
I'm a mighty me. pirate. I'm a mighty pirate. That means his skin will be leathery and his meat tough and the stringy. We'll give you one more chance to <sighs> trade something of yours Whoops. for your food. Okay, I think I just well. told them that I'm tasty, so let's see what we got here. Um, I thought maybe maybe we could give them the banana. Do you really think we want that? <laughs> After you've had your grubby paws all over. That's hilarious. Over what about the skull? Because maybe they can um. Maybe they can give, put the skull in front of the, the sacred monkey head. Oh man, I missed it. Us. Okay, we'll have to come back. Try the skull. That should do it. Oh, now they're boarding up the door. Wow. Yeah. Um. They clearly there's a giant open hole. They haven't figured that out. Okay, there's got to be something I can do. I pull the window. Oh, hello. I can't get through it. I can't move it. You can't move it. Open window. It doesn't open. It doesn't open. Okay, pick up banana picker. Let me push the banana picker out through the window. No, no, no. Use banana picker on window. There are no bananas to pick there. No, dude. I want to push it through the window. Uh, give banana picker to window. Oh, no, you won't even do that. Okay. Uh, well, let's let's go out again. Yeah, I might See if hole, but I maybe we can right. trade the skull or something with them. Um, they want something for the, the sacred monkey head, right? I love how they just skip the cutscene now, don't waste our time. Why are there, like, dead bodies hanging around? I thought these guys weren't cannibals anymore. Okay, let's talk to the, the natives. The locals. Well, well, well. You're quite the escape artist, aren't you? Two times lucky. I told you we should eat him. Third time's the charm. <laughs> Okay, uh, let's give you Don't something. I'll give you anything. Anything? Yeah. Mm. We'll give you one more chance to trade something of yours for your freedom. Well. Okay, um. The skull. Would you like that? Sorry, we already have plenty of those. <laughs> okay, um. I feel like I'm just gonna start trying random shit with them yeah. now. No thanks. You don't want a lens? How about a cannonball for the cannibals? Do you have of a more spiritual value? Obviously you have I don't know, I thought maybe us. they'd appreciate the malapropism of going cannonball instead of cannibal. That should do Now they're chaining it up, guys. <laughs> I'm actually curious how many ways they can lock this thing. So I now want to find out. <laughs> I love how the game isn't wasting our time. Like, once you've done it once, like, they just speed things up for you. That's, you know, that's good game design. Okay, let's trigger the cannibals again. How you get out is almost as much of a mystery as I know, I don't even know why I'm coming back. back. I guess that I just want to see how you guys lock it. Why he's not <laughs> simmering with carrots right now. <laughs> you know what, just eat me, I don't care. Go ahead and eat me. See if I care. Hey, whatever you say. <laughs> they just did it straight up. That should do wow. it. Wow. That's just a little bit extra, don't you think? I want to see if there's like anything beyond that level of lockup. If they can get like these gigantic safe doors, like I don't understand how, um, what's his name? Um, Herman Tuthard is trapped on this island. In a primitive yet effective way, it's locked. Primitive yet effective way? That ain't primitive, Guybrush. Uh, your adjective's a little mi mixed up. I don't know if this is getting boring for you, but it sure is for me. Okay, yeah, I think we've done it enough times. Let's escape and then we're done. See if I care. Hey, whatever you say. Maybe if we could get to the, the monkey head and steal one of the idols that's in front of it and give it back to them or something, maybe they might... Um... Maybe they might then let us go. Who knows? We'll have to see. Okay, let's go land on the beach. And go to the monkey head. Getting inside is going to be interesting. Because uh, last I checked, it wasn't easy. Um, like, there was a, a lever you had to pull, but holding the lever was not the easiest thing. And I think Shish Kebab, Shishka Joe, and Shishka Larry are still here, <laughs> which is great news. They haven't mysteriously moved. Okay, how do we get to the monkey head? 
Okay, um... Wow. We want to pull the nose. And now somehow we want to hold this nose open. Oh, you know what? I think... You know what? Actually, now I understand why we have the bananas. That makes sense. Okay. Makes perfect sense. Um... So I think it's a running gag in Monkey Island, I just totally forgot about it, where um, you can give bananas to monkeys and they will follow you. So, and you can get them to do what you want. So I think if we give bananas to this monkey, enough of them. I don't know if we should do all five in one go. Um, I mean, we know where the monkeys are, where the bananas are, right? So we can always try and go, go fetch some more if we need it. So let's do that. Um, let's give banana one to the monkey. And give banana two to the monkey. And maybe if we give all five to him, he'll follow us. Because I think if you give, like, if you give him one, he'll only follow you a certain distance or something like that. Um, and that's just frustrating. I'm not sure I want to waste my time on that. Uh, if not, we can always go fetch more bananas, right? We know where they are. I think. It just occurred to me, I don't remember where all of them are, actually. <laughs> we might have to knock um, one or two out of the tree again. Alright, the monkey's following us. Five bananas did the trick, it seems. Alright, yeah! Five bananas did it, guys. You really gotta overfeed these guys. I mean, if I ate five bananas, I wouldn't want more. I don't know <laughs> how hungry this monkey must be. Okay, if we pull this thing, is the monkey going to copy us? Okay, come on, do it, do it! Yay! Problem solved. Why, that's the second biggest monkey head I've <laughs> ever seen. Wow, okay, look at this. Hello, is that a Maniac Mansion reference? And actually, is it F10? Yeah, I remember that in the original it wasn't, it was a Sam and Max reference. So we might actually have Sam and Max on the channel at some point. It's a, they've done a bunch of Telltale sequels and I think I might try those out at some point. Um, yeah, that's super cool. It looks like a sacred idol of some kind. Right, we got a whole bunch of idols here. It looks like a sacred idol of some kind. It looks like a sacred idol some of these some look kind. like aliens. Like this one here looks like a Teletubby. It looks like a sacred idol of some kind. What about this little tiny one? What a cheap piece of mass-produced tourist crap. On the bottom it says, Made by Lemonhead. <laughs> okay. Uh, Made by Lemonhead. That must be one of the cannibals, right? I doubt anyone will miss this piece of junk. Can you pick up any of the others? This is much too heavy to pick up. And yet you can put a banana pick in your Let pants. Let alone carry around this godforsaken island for God knows what reason. But you'll carry the small one around. I haven't even told you why we're doing that yet. It looks yet. like a sacred idol of some kind. Wow. Okay. Um. So let's have a closer look at this monkey head. Definitely the second biggest monkey head I've ever seen. What is the biggest one, Guybrush? Do you ever tell us that? Or is that just like something you say every single game? <laughs> it's got a giant ear. The second largest ear I've ever seen. And also the dirtiest. Right! Ugh. If I remember correctly, the key is like a cotton swab that goes in its ear or something. <laughs> Disgusting. Okay, we have got our sacred idol. And our monkey is hanging out here. Made by Red Skull. Ah, from World War One, I, I guess. Isn't that in the future? <laughs> um, so we got our... We got our idol. Maybe we can give that to the cannibals except it says made by lemonhead It'd be really funny if he accepts that <laughs> come on guy bush row faster you row so slowly buddy and where's the music okay around the beach going into the jungle and back to the village and now we're gonna try and con them my logic here is is because they said something about something that they could use for the sacred monkey head, right? So that's why I thought of this. And if we can do that, maybe we can get them to give us the banana picker, which we can give to Herman to um, what now? get the key to the mo the monkey head. So don't eat let's me. try that. I'll give you anything. Okay. We'll give you one more <laughs> okay. chance to trade something of yours for your freedom. 
Well. Okay, come on. Keyboard, don't fail me now. Come on! No, not now! I need to change the batteries on this thing. Okay, let's give um wimpy little idol to the cannibals. Hey. Wow. This is impressive. Lemon head. <laughs> oh no, he's gonna figure oh, it out. Oh, that's nice. And it says made by Lemonhead. Just like one of mine. We should take this to the great monkey. <laughs> yes, I agree. Wow. We are very grateful to you for this fine gift. If there's anything you need on Monkey Island, just come see us. Well, speaking of that, there is actually something I would like. Where are you guys? You're in, you're in here? Oh, there's the banana picker. All right, I need to fix this keyboard. I don't know what it is doing. Um, I don't know if you guys get this problem. Like, I swear I've changed the battery on this thing so many times, and it's a pretty new keyboard. Uh, maybe I just need to try a different brand. <laughs> um, it's frustrating. Like, sometimes All it just I won't work. My banana picker back. But will they give it to me? You know, I was about to ask, they how am I going to find this guy? Key back first. Ha! That'll be the day. Don't what are you, you talking to? They're being unreasonable. Yeah. It's not as though I'm asking for a lot. Are you talking to the three-headed monkey? I'm confused. <clears throat> Very confused. Also, I love this um, red herring thing that they've just done to us. Like, they they literally just uh, made us think we needed oh, the banana picker. Banana picker back. You know, to get, get bananas. To um, but we didn't they even need that. Monkey head key back first. It was just so we could give it to Herman. It's That'll hilarious. Be the day. Hey, thanks. I thought I'd never see this again. <laughs> We're not even gonna use the banana picker, guys. It's a red herring. Okay. And don't worry, I won't use it or anything. <laughs> Especially since the natives aren't really here, right? I mean, they won't know if, if we don't return it. They think Herman still has it. Alright, let's go rescue Elaine, guys! Where do we find Herman if we ever need to speak to him? Or does he just show up when we need him? Because he's not in his fort. Whenever I go there, he's not there. He just like comes and finds you randomly. I guess that's Herman for you though. <laughs> Is this monkey still here? Guys, I hope at the end of the day we can tell this monkey to stop hanging off of this thing because I don't want him to die here. Okay, uh, let us use the key, which literally, like giant cotton swab. yeah, really weird. This ear needs some cleaning. <laughs> Ooh, that really fits in his pants. Ugh. Hello, secret tunnel, secret tunnel. Wow, this place is spooky. What the hell? The monkey head's got a giant skeleton underneath it. This is crazy, guys. Whoa. I had a feeling that in hell, there would be mushrooms. <laughs> you know, I really don't like mushrooms, guys. So I'm actually with Guybrush on this one. Every time someone gives me mushrooms, I'm just like, are you kidding me? I'm not going to eat this. <laughs> wow. That would be my definition of hell, actually. Mushrooms. <clears throat> yeah. That's eternal torture. <laughs> There's like random skulls on these things. I wonder what they look like in the original. Wow, look how spooky that is. And the music sounds so weird. I kind of like the new art style though. You know, I know some people have been a bit iffy about it. I like it. It's cool, it's dope. Hmm. Oh, okay. This place is very confusing. Where does he- Oh, hello! Look at that weird face! Gross. Right? Um... I'm getting very confused now. There's a million ways we can walk. Oh no, don't tell me this is gonna be like Melee Island. We have to get a map or something? Whoa! There's a heart, guys! That's spooky. Yuck. Okay, I, I don't want to get lost. Uh, oh, hello, those heads are there. Whoa, guys, what happened to the cave? I want to go look at the heads. <gasps> guys, this map is changing around us. I think we're in trouble. Creepy. 
I think we need to get out of here somehow. How are we gonna get out? How are we gonna get out? <laughs> We're stuck. We're lost in here. Guys, no, I don't know how to do this. Okay. Whew. <laughs> I was like, if we get lost in here, that's a huge problem. Wow. Okay, so it's official that we need some kind of map to get through here. Um, who, how are we going to get a map? Who are we going to talk to? There's only the cannibals, really, right? We can't track down Herman Tutor. I mean, you could try, but he's not going to be anywhere we look for him. Let's try. Let's see if we can catch Herman Toothrot. Maybe he's at the fourth or something. If not him, we'll, we'll go talk to the cannibals or something. Um, yeah. Hmm. It's not like... It would be great if we could like go back to Melee Island and find the, um, the shady looking guy and buy a map from him. Actually, you know, I wonder if we don't have something in our inventory that would tell us how to get through the cave. Um, maybe it's something silly that we've had with us all along. There you are, you Lee I'm not bothered a bit by the fact that you waltzed right into my home without bothering to not. I want to say hi, dude. Would like some help. Um. <laughs> well, I would have knocked, but I couldn't find a door. You know, the truth, hey? Well, that's okay. Next time, be more careful. Sure. Gabrish, you don't want to ask about navigating the... Excuse me, I've got some pressing business to attend to. Why did I come here? Yes, me too. <laughs> A lot of good you are, Herman. You literally do nothing for us. Okay, let's go chat to the the cannibals. If they don't have an answer, then... Uh, then I don't know. I'm going to have to sit and think on this one. And come back next time with a solution, I guess. <laughs> uh, we'll have to see. I'm sure it won't be that crazy, though, right? Monkey Island doesn't have that many moon logic puzzles. So moon logic puzzles are ones that, like, there's no way to guess the answer. You just have to, like, try everything in your inventory. Um, it happens occasionally, but Monkey Island's a lot better than most of the older games. So it shouldn't happen that much. Um, I think we already had our moon logic one with the rubber chicken with the pulley in the middle, basically. I think that was the only moon logic puzzle so far. Um, everything else has been sort of clever, right? Okay, they're here. Let's chat Have to them, see what they got. Let us repay you for your fine gift? Yes, tell me how to find the chuck. Well, actually, there is something. Tell us, what is it? I need a ship. I need a ship. <laughs> I'm just going to try everything. You here if you don't have a ship? Uh, I sunk it. Well, this big rock fell out of the sky. I see. <laughs> Say no more. Well, I'm sorry, but we don't have a ship. Is there anything else we could do for you? Well, at least they're offering other stuff. Money. I want money. That's not exactly what Yeah, they, they probably don't have money. Is there anything else? Like, they're self-sufficient. Do they don't need to trade. I'm looking for somebody. Yes, maybe you can help me. Here? Yes. On Monkey Island? We're the only people living on Monkey Island. Well, the only civilized <laughs> people. I love this, you know, um, that they comment on these things. Uh, yeah, I just came to the wrong island. No. Um, looking for 30 dead guys and one woman. I'm looking for 30 dead guys and one woman. I don't think I want to hear any more about it. Wow, just like that. Wait, maybe he's talking about those dead pirates. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Those guys. Then you've seen the ghost pirate LeChuck and his cadaverous crew? Those jerks have been bugging us for months. Zooming around here in that creepy ghost <laughs> Can ship. Can you zoom around in a ship? Is that even possible? And moaning until all hours of the morning. Scaring away all the cruise ship business? Normally, when we have problems with the undead, we just cook up our standard potion of exorcism <laughs> and be done with it. So why don't you do that now? So why don't you do that now? Well, the main ingredient of the potion yes, is a very the voodoo anti -root. root. In fact, there's only one in existence. Mm -hmm. We only use and a little bit stole time, it. you see. Because you only got to kill a few ghosts at a time, right? <laughs> also, why is there only one root? How does that make sense? Like, what plant is it from that 
Only has one root and never reproduces. That's Le weird. Chuck came in here and stole your root? What a cad. And I suppose stealing bananas is any better. Uh, yes. Bananas are not voodoo roots. <laughs> where is he hiding it? He's in a place beneath this island. Yeah, okay, I know where he Somewhere is, kind of. A huge system of catacombs. Okay, a we're getting to business now. Filled with the wailing of tortured souls trapped forever in the rock. Where yeah, the I think I saw them. <laughs> and the air is thick with the rancid smell of pure evil. They do a good job describing it. <laughs> hours to see it. Um. <laughs> yeah, that's hilarious. What happened? Health department shut you down? I mean, I would if I saw that cavern. No, we lost the key. It was <clears> stolen. <throat> well, we loaned it to a hermit who lives on the island. Just and in case you haven't heard this elsewhere. Old pantless weirdo brings pantless. it back. We're <laughs> keeping his banana picker. Um. I'm off to All right. Chuck and get the root. I guess they're not gonna help us. Sorry, but it's just not that easy. Okay, thank you. They pointed it out. Chuck could be very dangerous. You'd never find your way through the catacombs without them. Without hey, them? Ixnay on the head hay of the navigator nay. Head of the uh, navigator? The Nothing. Nothing. Mm, they spoke pig Latin. It's way at way at way at the art hay. I haven't done it in ages, but I guess it is kind of hard. <laughs> um Ude uye av way a way at me of way ye catacombs k. Do you have a just translating for you guys? Do you have a map of the catacombs? Uh, Pig Latin is awesome. You just take like the first consonant of a word and you put it at the back with an a. So it's it's really easy, and your brain can sort of figure it out if you've done it enough times. Ude uye av hey a at me of a of a catacombs k. Sorry, say oh no. Sorry, no. We could at least tell him what the head does. Well, it's a navigating tool. It's a head. It's a head. <laughs> it was once attached to a navigator. Oof! We've kept it alive magically, so we could take advantage of its innate sense of direction. Did Getting he consent the to this? without it is impossible. But it's our only one, so you can't have it. I guess we have nothing to offer you. After well, now we gotta steal the head. Idle too. Feel free to come to the Great Monkey and visit your island <laughs> any time. Um, <clears throat> so, anyway, Lemonhead, what was that you were saying about tropical oils? Well... Huh, so I guess... Okay, that's our problem. We gotta figure out how do you, how do you steal the head from them somehow. So I guess we'll do that next time when we come back on Monkey Island. And then we're gonna sneak into LeChuck's underground lair and try and rescue the governor. I mean, we're basically there, I guess. So, yeah. I'll see you guys next time on Monkey Island. Until then, stay safe and stay wholesome, I guess. Have fun. See you guys. Bye for now.